Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. All right. Yo, 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 this is Games and Graphics, we are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you, and uh, this one is for 5M, okay, so it's uh, very important that you know that the main requirement for this is 5M, before we go any further, alright, this isn't for single player at all, this is for 5M server, okay, so we'll Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump on into it. This one is for the Hypnonema uh, Cinema Resource, okay? This is how we could watch, um, I, I would say movies or uh, different videos and stuff like that inside of our server, all right? Uh, this one is made by uh, Sim Simple Dev, okay? That is the creator of this right here. Shout out to the creator. Um, when you get down to this link, right? This will be in the description. What you want to do is scroll down and you want to read everything in its description, okay? They also have table of contents, so you can skip to certain parts, but I suggest that you read all parts, okay? Just scroll down and read all of this very important information, okay? Now, uh, without, um, uh, after you get done reading everything, uh, right here, you want to scroll down to where it says download, okay? After you get done reading everything in here, all right? Scroll down to where it says download and you want to select releases, okay? Once you select releases, it will lead you to this GitHub page right here. That is the releases for Hypnonema, all right? You always want to select the first one right here. The first one will always be the latest release, okay? After you get done uh, coming right here, you want to select hypnonema.zip to download, okay? Once you select this, you will be prompted to download. Remember where you download it also, okay? Now let's go back to uh, the download page and there will be another link called uh, repository. Okay, go ahead and select that link as well. And when you select this repository uh, link, it will lead you to this page right here. Let me scroll up. It will lead you to this page right here. Now this one will look different than the first GitHub page, okay? So once you get to this page, just go ahead and scroll down. You will also see a table of contents, but this is the main part I want you to focus on. Also, there's uh, two parts. It's ACE permissions right here. This is uh, one important thing we're going to need to add to our server.cfg in order to bring up um, the window for Hypnonema. All right. And we're also um, going to use this for our example map. These are our coordinates for our example map that's going to come with our download. Okay. So, um, now that we have that all done and also it lets you know how you could change the command okay we won't be changing the command we're going to use the default command for today but just keep this in mind right here on this repository page okay now let's go ahead and um let's see let's make sure we cover everything on this page and also if you wanted to uh if you wanted to make new uh, areas instead of using the example map if you wanted to watch movies somewhere else uh, say like if you wanted to watch movies in um, a house around the map or anything like that they do have um, some instructions on how you can play it on tv anywhere and uh, they have a list right here okay so once you select this link that says outdated this link will lead you right here to this paste bin page okay um, they will have a long list of uh, pretty much all of the TVs or screens that's in the game that you could, you know, play on, all right? Now, they will have um, the name and they will have the targeting name as well, okay? We're going to go through that also, okay? But just this is a list just in case you wanted to play movies or TV uh, somewhere else in the game, okay? On another prop, of course. All right, so now uh, that we have our... Hypnonema downloaded right here from our hypnonema.zip. On my left hand side, I have uh, just that one download, Hypnonema, Hypnonema. And I have also my uh, server opened up right here. This will be uh, my server. So like I said, it's very important that you have your uh, server already together and uh, you already have 5M installed, okay? 
So I have my server right here on my right hand side. What I'm going to do is navigate to my resources, wherever your resources is inside your server. Also, I will leave a link down in the description showing you how to uh, create your own server if you don't have one, all right? So what you wanna do is find your resource folder. Once you have your resource folder opened up, go ahead and let's go back to the downloads where we had the Hypnonema download. Go ahead and open that one up. Inside that folder is going to be two folders. It's going to be one that says Hypnonema, and then it's gonna be a second one that says Hypnonema um, slash map, okay? We are going to be installing both of these today, okay? So what we're gonna do is just grab both of these folders, make sure they're highlighted. And we're going to drag and drop both of these folders right here into our resource folder in our server. All right. And you should see it added right there inside your resource folder. Okay. Now that that has been added, let's go ahead and navigate back to our server and go down to our server dot SVG. Uh, SFG, excuse, uh, CFG, excuse me, <laughs> getting everything mixed up. This is what we want to edit right here, is our server CFG, okay? So go ahead and open up your server CFG. So we could just add start. Now we're, look, let's go back to our downloads and just uh, copy that name. Copy and go back to my server and just paste that name. And we want to create another start for the map. The hip hypnonemia map the uh, hypnonema map there we go and go back down to our server and paste it all right so it should look something like this right here in your server doesn't have to be perfect or nothing like that long as you um, create start and then add the name okay so when we run the server it's going to run every resource in our resource folder. After you get done adding start hypnonema and start hypnonema map, go ahead and select file and select save. Right now we are going to come back to um, the repository page. Uh, this is the link right here on the download page. Once you click on this, it will lead you to the repository page. Uh, we were here earlier in the video and um, we need to go to the ACE permissions part and we are going to copy this line right here. All right, let's go ahead and copy that line. And uh, we're gonna bring up our server CFG and we are going to paste that same line that we just copied right here, okay? Now, after we do that, we are going to have to put in our Steam ID, okay? We're going to put in our Steam ID right here. Uh, this is how you get your Steam ID. There will be another link down in the description and it's going to lead you to this page right here where they explain how you could find your um, your steam id on steam all right so definitely check out this link it shows you how to find it it even shows you if you can't see it or if you have a custom one as well all right so once you follow this you will be able to find your steam id then you want to enter in your Steam ID right here inside that line we pasted that says Steam ID here, okay? You want to paste right over this with your Steam ID. Once you're done doing that, go ahead and select File and Save, all right? Now we can go ahead and uh, start up our server and I'll meet you once the server is started up. All right, once you spawn in your server, uh, what you wanna do is press pause, open up the menu, and you wanna teleport over here towards the parking lot at the beach, all right? It's gonna be located right here, all right? This is where our um, hypnonemia map is gonna be at, our uh, cinema. So let's go ahead and teleport over there. All right, when you teleport over here, you should notice there's a big ass movie screen right here at the parking lot on the beach, okay? It's going to say hypnonemia at the top. And at nighttime, uh, it has spotlights and everything that um, that light up right there on the corner, all right? So at this point, what you wanna do is um, open up your command uh, window um, where you enter in commands. Mines, I, I press T and that opens up this command box right here. Uh, press forward slash and then spell spell hip no 
Neymar. And once you enter it in, then uh, a window will pop up right here. All right. Now, for the first time, uh, when you install this, you're not going to have any screens um, set up. So you're going to need to set up your screens. And this is where uh, this comes in handy at right here. Our uh, respiratory. I, I think it's res Did I say it right? <laughs> but this one uh, right here, which is... Uh, this link right here repository there you go the repository link that will lead you right here scroll all the way down and they will have um, the corresponding values for the screen at the sample map are as follows okay so position X we're gonna have to go ahead and uh, enter these in okay so what I'm gonna do is uh, make this window a little bit smaller right here we're gonna go back over to this screen right here and make sure that you have selected screens and then go right here to create new screen go ahead and select it um, you can give your screen a name um, I'm just gonna say beach all right and you could you could uh, enable it to be always on if you want but for right now we're just gonna just name it and then click next after you click next uh, what we want to do is check is 3d rendered okay once you select that then it's going to give our coordinates right here that we have to fill in okay so um it's automatically going to have that zero there so make sure that you erase that zero all right before you paste in your coordinates okay so we're just going to go back and forth to uh the repository page where it had the coordinates and just copy those coordinates and place them in their right place all right now that you have um, everything entered in its right place all right you have a uh, double check just to make sure that you have everything entered in just how it's uh, said right here and then once you have everything in there incorrectly press next that will lead you to uh, the sound setting page um, I suggest leaving it how it is right here for right now and then press submit all right once you press submit then you will see that you have a screen up okay it's gonna say actions uh, you'll be able to edit it delete it you'll see the name and if you uh, we'll, we'll get into the model name and the render target name later okay but for right now this is uh, always on and it's um, it's on false because we didn't want it on all right so once you have your screen set up um, right here you want to go to quick play and inside here where it says screen it's going to uh it's going to highlight all the screens that you made since we only made one it's going to have that one up which is beach go ahead and select it and now you're going to need a link to put in the url all right so for right now um i'm going to go ahead and grab a uh, youtube link now i'm going to grab a youtube link right here i'm going to copy that copy and we are going to put that right here in the URL and then press play okay I'm gonna look right at the screen so as you can see you see the movie screen right here in front of my character once you get the once you put the screen on the screen you just created and then put in the URL click play might have to click play a couple of times and then eventually you will start to see the video play in the background right there but this is my video in the background right here. This is my YouTube video. Uh, when you're done um, getting your video started, you can go ahead and press this X button right here to exit out of there. And as you can see, there is the movie screen right here, y'all. All right. Now, um, if you read the download page, there are a couple of sites where uh, their videos are supported with the Hypnonema, Hypnonema uh, Cinema. All right, so definitely check out the download page so you can see what other websites videos you can use on hypno Nima. all right all right now um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to get this to work with um, let me stop my character from pointing all right now if you wanted to uh, stop it I'm gonna press uh, you want to press T open up your command window forward slash hypno Nima. that will open up this window right here um, if you go to status status right here you will see the um, 
you will see the screens right here, but only screens I've seen right here are the ones that have rendered targeting, okay? Uh, the ones like the one right here where we use uh, 3D rendering uh, doesn't seem to show up right here for me, okay? I'm not going to say for everybody, but for me it doesn't seem to, okay? So this is how I uh, stop the video when I'm at the beach on the Hypno Nima map. I, uh, I press in the same... Uh, URL I had before and I take off a couple of letters and then I select that same screen that we made for this uh, hypnonema map right here and I press play see since I took off a couple of uh, letters out of the URL and press play um, obviously it did not play it because it's missing some letters alright so that's how uh, that's a quick little way I found out how to stop it if you don't want to just leave it playing alright now uh, next up we are going to head to um right here we're gonna head to this movie theater right here all right now i'm gonna use this theater right here because this one has uh i have opened all interiors and um we could ex we could enter into this one without having to see the movie okay we just walk right up and enter the interior of the theater all right Okay, so now we have, we are inside our uh, theater in the movie. Now, in order to get this one, we are going to have to, uh, let's go ahead and press um, our command window and then enter in the same command for hypnonema. And that's going to bring up this one right here. All right. Now, what we want to do is select screens. And then select uh, create new screen. Now I am going to create a new screen, so I'm going to give it a different name. I'm going to give it a name Cinema. And I'm going to select next. And then render targeting settings. This is where we are going to enter in our model name as well as our render target name. Now you can find uh, if you want to use a TV in the room or something like that. Um, you can go ahead and use that link from the outdated link from the download page from earlier. They will have a bunch of TV model names, including the target, uh, the targeting name also. Okay, so any one of these that uh, you want to use, feel free to check it out if you would, if you want to use a TV inside of a house. Okay, all right. So once we have in the uh, model, the model name, and then the render target name, let's press next, and then we could select submit. Once that's submitted, let's go ahead and go back to uh, Quick Play. Select the new screen we just made, Cinema. And then uh, let me go ahead and get a YouTube link, copy, and then put that into the URL, paste. And then look at the screen, select Play. There we go. You might need to select play once or twice and then um, after that you should see the video start to play in the movie theater all right so you could um play movies or videos down at the beach you could play them in the movie theaters you could play them at the house you just have to uh, create a new screen and enter in the proper model name and rendering target name all right so uh yeah that's pretty much gonna do it for me folks right here I'm going to go ahead and uh, watch the rest of my little movie right here. But if this helped y'all out to install it, or if y'all just enjoyed the video, smash that like button for your boy. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with y'all friends that are in a modding GTA 5, y'all. Or modding 5M as well. This is Games and Graphics. Me and my MP character, man. We're going to chill out. We out of here until next time, y'all. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.